But yeah, a police report confirms that this investigation started last month, late last month, when the Department of Homeland Security contacted local police. James Saylor was working as a school bus driver when Homeland Security contacted Goshen police about him. The 61 year old was arrested February 8th, accused of downloading child porn at his home. A complaint filed in Claremont County Municipal Court says Saylor denied viewing any child porn and consented to a police search of his devices. Court documents say an analysis of Saylor's laptop found four images of prepubescent females engaged in a sexual performance with adult men. Saylor worked for Peterman, which contracts with local school districts. The company tells WNWT he was immediately fired when they learned of his arrest. Goshen Local Schools uses Peterman services. The school board did not address the incident during tonight's regularly scheduled meeting. Superintendent Daryl Edwards declined an interview, but earlier released a statement saying immediately upon learning of the criminal investigation, we told Peterman that their employee was not to be driving one of our buses and was not to be in contact with our students in any way. Edwards said police confirmed none of the alleged crimes happened on school property. He says the district plans to follow up with the company about its background checks. Peterman writes before any driver begins work in driving, a comprehensive background check is run. This includes running the individual's information through an FBI database and fingerprinting. The ODE reviews the background checks as well for any criminal activity. So Saylor is charged with pandering obscenity involving a minor, which is a felony. He has a preliminary hearing set for Thursday at one o'clock and his bond still at jail here sent at seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars. We're live in Batavia tonight. Jatara McGee, WLWT News 5.